<laughs> when you listen to Grant speak, I think you look at Grant and go, that kid's gonna run for president someday if he wants to, right? The, the way he carries himself and just what he is involved in. There are so many things that he's doing, so many clubs he's involved in. Any time we have someone, I think, from the athletic department that needs to speak to a group of alums, it seems like his name gets brought up and he's the one standing in front of that group and he is not even close to intimidated in any way, shape, or form. I think it's just continuing to like be a serial learner. So like for me, like I like to learn a lot of different things. I decided to major in political science because I wanted to get a better understanding of the world. So uh, not only just from practical history that you get, uh, but actually how we as individuals affect our government and as well as affect other governments in the world. I had to take a lot of different courses. So that's from 3D fundamentals, I took photography, which is probably my favorite thing. I like photography a lot. But like actually doing the projects, like working with my hands, like actually trying to visualize things and how they can you know, relate to how someone actually uh, interacts with my piece is something I got really into. I worked for Flex Investments LLC, which is a startup um, real estate investment function. They work in both fix and flips of properties and also in Section 8 housing. So trying to build units that will have affordable housing that can get people into homes. So to actually have somewhere to live. So seeing how you know you learn about people having poverty in different nations and even in our own nation in my, my, in my major, you actually get to see guys who are using their experience to come back and try to do something that's better for other people. He understands a perspective. He doesn't just think in a, in a tiny little microscopic view about how it impacts him. He thinks about how these decisions we're making as a coaching staff and as a team really affect everyone, right? And he thinks about the pluses and minuses. He does it with a ton of empathy, and he really has the ability to dive deep into what situations may arise. I think when you go out into the world, you see that, like, I'm not gonna be around people who are exactly like me. I really don't wanna be around people who are exactly like me, because then I won't learn anything. So when I engage, like, different people from different cultures, or I learn about different things from different places around the world. It allows me to expand my worldview and allows me to make me holistically a better person. I think that's one of the things in life that's more important to me is being a better person. You know, people may not remember how I affected them on the football field or if I made an interception or if I helped win a game, but they'll remember how I made them feel. And I think that's what's most important to me is that when I leave Holy Cross and, you know, I hope I leave it better than I found it, but the people that are on this team when I'm gone, the coaches that are here, the people that are in athletics, the people who are you know, students here in the administration, I left a positive impact on the people that I encountered.